It's the way we see things. Your best friend died, it sucks. Get over it. That's part of life. Yeah, I mean, I, I've had friends die in the military, my dog father died. Um, you know, if you look at nature itself, there's a cyclical life span. Everything dies and there's a winter, spring, and summer. That's life, it's how it is. It's how we deal with these things in life that we find out who we are. And if we deal with them in the correct way, then we really get the real blessings of life, the real power moments that really stand at this time. But most of those moments, they don't come, um, they, they don't come presented to you. No one can give them to you, you have to earn them. Those moments are like getting up in the morning and training your ass off for a marathon and the day you cross that finish line, the exhilaration of victory, the way you feel, as great as that is, people coming across the line, you look at it, you're like, wow, I want to be part of that. Well, that moment, was paid for through, through you know, years maybe, or months of training, when no one was watching, no one wanted to do it. They paid their time for that. You know, these moments of depression when things go wrong, once you overcome them, you become stronger from them. And it's that moment in life later that is built upon failure, same with success. Success is never gotten on the first time you join. It's failure to failure to failure, learning from your failures from one to another to another. You know, trying, even if you get knocked down, you continue to try and continue to try. And sure, you never fail to try. It, it's, it's that mentality. It's the mentality, bring it on, motherfucker. I can take it. You can't break this shit. I'm stronger than you think I am. And everything you throw at me and all the hardships you throw at me, you might knock me down, but I get back up and I'll be stronger for it. It's that mentality that builds an iconic status that, that you see centuries from now people still talk about. The small pitfalls in life, the uh, um, deaths in families, or a girl breaking up with you, getting fired from a job, losing your money. These are all lessons. They really are. They're just the, the presence in a way. But it's the perception of how you see that presence. Do you allow it to destroy you, or do you allow it to change you? Is it a wake-up call saying, hey, got to get off this path onto something else? It's a state of mind, guys. It's not a state of reality. I can't say that enough.